Hey Dave, come here quick, there's something you gotta see. That man has got a dancing bear tied up to that old tree. And it's dance, dance, Dakota dance, all around the country store. Me and sweet Betty ain't never seen a bear that can dance before. Well, it's a one step, two step, three step, four. Follow Dakota and he dance some more. Oh, it is cold. It is 36. That's what it says but in the car, but I don't believe it. Um, So I had to come over here to O'Reilly. <laughs> That's what I like to call it instead of O'Reilly. It's O'Reilly's <laughs> Auto Parts and get a quart of OW40 for my car. So we're going to go back to the house and put this in real quick before we head to Lawrence. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so here's underside the hood. So the dipstick is actually like back there, but this is where the oil goes right here. So go ahead and get this off. Oh, I need an oil change. That's too dark. Your oil is supposed to be like a yellowish kind of color. That's dark. So in here in this box, I have a small if I can get it open, y'all. The filter. It's tiny as fuck. I need to get a bigger one. But um look how you can like see the <laughs> that just like baffles me. Okay, so here's our OW40 for European cars. So we're going to go ahead and put this in there. Just going to put the cap back on. So we got our first order. I wasn't even freaking paying attention which store it was. I just grabbed it because it was like $34 only going, I'll toss up, going 2.2 miles. But it's all the way on the other side of town. So now I gotta drive on to the other side of town, but oh well. Yeah, we gotta go to the Mass Street Dillon, y'all. So that's where we're heading to. So let's go. Okay, here's our order. This is order A and they have a case of soda. Then order B and they have it. Eight distilled waters, y'all. So, there you get Okay, order A is right here. We got order B packed in there. Let's go. Look, y'all. One customer, the last customer, even though they did not meet me at the door, they wanted their groceries dropped off, requested that I wear a damn mask. Okay, you're lucky I want your tip. Otherwise, I wouldn't be doing this. Because in y'all, in my personal opinion, that's an infringement on my personal right. Call it what you want. I'm sure I'll get hate in comments. But, um, so with the whole, uh, vid thing, um, I am not vaccinated, nor will I ever get vaccinated. Oh, so why do people have to keep getting, you know, more and more of the vaccines? Well, y'all... I know more people that have gotten the vaccine that have had the vid after the vaccine. I'm sure I've had the vid and didn't know it. The big guy has had it a couple times. He hasn't been vaxxed. He, he's had the vid. <clears throat> and y'all, I was having sex with that mofo while he had the vid and nothing happened to me. So y'all, I know that's TMI, but I'm just trying to prove my point. Like, the only reason why I put that mask on, I'm like, you ain't even coming out here. Are you afraid I'm going to cough all over your door or something? Like, you ain't even, you wanted your groceries set outside. I already touched them all, so what does it matter? You know what I mean? You guys, I, and then the first customer, their house wasn't even marked with their address. I just had to go by whatever the, uh, the navigation was telling me that I was there. I was like, oh, okay, I guess I'm here. Yeah, the only reason why I put that mask on, and they lucky us, so I went in the car, um, was the guarantee that I get my tip. You know, because I don't want them messing with my tips because they'd be like, you know, feeling some type of way that I ain't wearing a mask. Well, I'm not telling you to not wear a mask, so why are you telling me to wear one? 
and believe me, I know people that one of my very dear friends passed away from the vid. He passed away, but he was he was on dialysis and stuff like that. So and he got it from the doctor's office. And then when they put him on those iron lungs, that's when it got worse. When they put those respirators on him, that's when it got worse for him. So, you know, I'm not trying to come on here and push my personal beliefs on anybody, but don't push your beliefs on me. Everyone is entitled to feel how they feel. Okay, everyone is entitled to say what they want to say. That's the beautiful thing about this country. It's called free speech. So we can say whatever the hell we want. Anybody can say whatever the hell they want. And you can get offended, you can get mad, you can feel however you want. But that's the beautiful thing about difference of opinions. If everybody had the same damn opinion, this world would be boring. Why can't we, you know, all just agree to disagree, y'all? Agree to disagree. That's a good way to put it. But y'all, I just had to come on here and say that. But the only reason why I put that mask on is because I, I was securing my tips, y'all. I'm like, I'll secure I'll uh, make you feel better about yourself or whatever is going on, but I'm not coming in your house. I'm not touching your front door. I'm not doing anything. You told me to leave it on the table by the front door, and that's exactly what I did, my friend. I did exactly what you asked of me. All right, let's see what else we can get into today. Guess what? We're going into the Lord's Craft Store. All right, let's do like a mini um, Lord's Craft Store haul, y'all. Um... So I picked up four of these. These are like, these are um, drawstring gift bags. They're burlap and then that's what they look like when they're open. These were $6.99 and then they were half off so I made them $3.49. These I'm going to put, um, so back in the day, when I lived in PA, I was kind of not, I don't want to say famous, but I was well known for doing light up burlap bags. And I used to like paint on the front of them and everything like that. Well, y'all, these are already pre like decorated. So we're going to put like the chicken wire fencing inside, lights attached to the chicken wire fencing and put those inside. I'll have to do a video on that. I'm going to sell those at my craft show. Then I need to pick up this ribbon. It was $2.99 and then there was 40% off of that. Um, this to finish one of the crafts. If you watched my um, Christmas crafting video that I did like last week or maybe the week before. Um, I had this in red and made two little mini ladders with wreaths on them. So I needed a black one. And then I got some red sprinkles. And these were $4.99 and then 50, or not 50, but 40% off of that. These are gonna go in the reindeer food. I was gonna do glitter and, so my kids, when they did it, they would do glitter and um, the oatmeal. But my kids were smart enough to know you can't eat glitter. And I was thinking about it and I was like, what if some of these kids, their parents are not paying attention, not with them when they're making it and they eat the damn glitter and then I'm, you know, then they're calling me. So I'm like, I ain't trying to have that. So we're gonna do sprinkles, little package of different kinds of holiday sprinkles with the oatmeal that they can mix together to make the reindeer food. And so that's what I picked up there. I spent um, $20.48 that included the tax. Um, they had some other of these bags that I wanted to do, but I was like, you know what? Let's just keep it simple because the other bags were smaller and they were the same price. And I was like, I want more bang for my buck. And so those were bigger. So we're gonna go with those ones. But um, yeah, let's get back to Instacarting. Okay, we got our next order. It's a little one. 
10 items, only going 1.2 miles. I'll toss it up for you. We're going to Sprouts. Um, so yeah, something to do instead of sitting here. Uh, when I do sit here, I'm watching YouTube videos, especially uh, body cam footage, because uh, I think some of that stuff is hilarious, y'all. It's fun. Guess it makes me feel better about myself. <laughs> So yeah, let's go get this order. Okay, here's our order, you guys. Let's go deliver. It took a little longer because some items were out of stock. So let's what go. What the hell? You ever see them firefighters in the grocery stores getting the groceries and you just thinking, I think my car's on fire. <laughs> Yo, we got some crazy high rebates happening right now. Okay, y'all, so I'm in the Walmart. All of these cereals are only $1 per box. So I already got myself some, but my sister sent me back in to get more. And there's an Ibotta rebate on this one. I'll tell you more about that later. But these were all one freaking dollar. So yeah, you guys, super awesome. Keep a lookout. Okay, we're back from our insane cereal haul, you guys. So, um, I gotta be quick because it's getting dark. And I do not like to drive in the dark. So, the Maria's cereal, they marked them down even more. They were on clearance for 75 cents a box. And then there's a $1.50 back on each box on Ibotta. So, making these free and a 50 cent money maker on each box. Then they had... All those cereals I showed you, but you guys, these Captain Crunch ones, the family size of the Halloween, these were on sale in there for a dollar, and then there's two dollars back on each box, so making them free and a dollar money maker. And then I got lucky on some of these, um, the Screamin' Sicilian pizzas. They had this one, the meat one, and the supreme one. These were marked down to $2 a piece. And then there was 75 cents back on Ibotta. So making them only $1.25 each. You guys, I was actually going to make pizza tonight. But I'm like, guess what? You get in this. And these are good pizzas, you guys. So, um... I'm super excited about it. Okay, we need to get home because it's getting dark and I got groceries in the car, you know. <laughs> we racing against the sun setting. Me a sweet Betty ain't never seen a bear that can dance before. It's a one step, two step, three step, four. Follow the go to any dance more. Dance, dance, to go to dance all around the country store. 